Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we've checked out a lot of rockets in the past. Guys, today we are here to check out a rocket like no other. We are going to check out something more incredible than anything we have seen before. This man spent 300 hours of his life on this build. Oh, we are going to check it out. And I'm excited, guys. And you should be too. Guys, right here we are with Arthur Rayevsku, guys. You might have seen him from previous videos. Guys, this man has dedicated himself to one of the craziest projects that the world world has ever seen and guys today we are gonna check it out so guys can i can i just show it off like it started december 2019 <laughs> okay guys welcome to the hyperion guys this is by far one of the craziest rockets that i have ever seen and guys not only is this just a rocket guys this is actually an entire beautiful project right here guys there's multiple other beautiful things around it guys not only just that this thing actually launches off to the end <laughs> Dude, this looks insane. I am so excited to check it out. Uh, what are we doing right here? <laughs> F2 Fred. This is Fred's locker. Damn, this is kind of gross, man. But also kind of sick. <laughs> so where should we even start with this build, guys? I kind of feel like we should just have a look around it and just see all of the beauty that this actual build entails. Uh, it's an absolute juicer. And I am beyond excited to actually check it out. So guys, right here, uh, we have a little bit of a watchtower. Is this a watchtower? I think this is a watchtower. Watchtower. Hyper watchtower. Exactly. So, guys, we just opened the door. Oh, my God. That actually worked really well. And, oh, my God. What? Okay, we climb up. Here we are. Whoa. There's a controllable chair right here. Does it do anything? It's just so cool how you've built in the actual Borderlands style. Like, honestly, man. Like, I haven't like I haven't seen anyone do anything like this yet with, like, the cartoony style. And, guys, if you don't know what I'm talking about. Here, you know what? I can actually. Here, guys. For some reason, the actual frames per second is absolute garbage right now. Uh, But, guys, as you can see, this right here is the actual game that, uh, that a lot of his builds are based off of. And, as you like, can see right here, if I look at for example this car or something like this like you just see the inspiration and it's so sick like honestly hello mr chew ah! Ah! get me out of game I don't, i'm done ah! all right now that there's been uh dogs running after me um i think we're back in build mode. hey i like this game more <laughs> so guys moving on we are gonna head towards the actual launcher itself guys we're okay there's this okay this is actually really sick okay um this is a little oh it's a little zip line oh Oh, this is awesome. Okay, so I'm just sitting here. Now, let's see how... Oh, my God. How cool. It's like a slow little little zip line ride. This is awesome. All right, Arthur. I think uh, I think uh, you maybe made it a little bit too short, but it's okay. I'm a professional hobby player. Yeah. And as completely intended, guys, here we are on the Hyperion, guys. One of the craziest things about this actual build is the fact that this was actually made before the microblock update. He made this when this was actually insane. So guys, that just makes this whole build 10 times crazier. Guys, we actually have to get over to the other side. So we're gonna have to use the zip line once more, um, actually. <laughs> so Tom, cue the elevator music! And we've made it to the top of the elevator. Guys, as you can see right here. Ooh, where are we? Oh, we need to... Oh, how did you even open that up? Oh, that's cool. So, guys, I think this th this right here is actually the station that brings us down into the rocket. But before we go there, we have to go check out the armory, I think this is. Oh, yeah, boy! Guys, this is where... Oh, my God, dude. The amount of little things, the amount of little details in this thing is insane! Oh, this is like some, like, Borderlands 3 lore that I don't know about. <laughs> I've got, like, five minutes in the game. <laughs> here, the ammo dump. Oh, Z plus med. Dude, these are some OG things. These look so cool. Okay, let's move up a little bit right here and, uh... Oh, boy. What is this right here? Oh my God, this is one of the legendary chests! I know this! Oh, this is like, uh... I don't know what this is. This little vault? Little zag? Oh, this is so sick. Dude, the way you did this transparent. Oh, my God, that looks insane. What? This is what computer monitors of the future will look like. This looks so cool. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, it's clapped! I love crap trap! Crap trap! Ow! Dude, this is awesome, man. Okay, let's head down here. And let's actually open this door. Dude, it's so cool, man. Okay, we have one little uh, final area over here. And that's when we will launch the rocket. 
Oh, you could open it. Oh, that's dope. Dude, you could have probably actually, now that I think about it, using some quirky mechanics, actually used one of these chests to actually anchor some parts of a specific block to it. Whoa, whoa, okay. I just, I was gonna say you can open the chest like that, but there's a, whoa, that is sick. Bro, that's so much detail. That is mad. Bro, that looks awesome, man. Long bow high period. I wish I had that in the real game. Maybe those dogs wouldn't have killed me. <laughs> okay, guys, here we have a little bit of a small warehouse. Oh, okay, we're clicking this button 10 times. Pandora's Express. Rest. Ooh, little pizza delivery. That is totally not pizza delivery. <laughs> little, little armory. Oh, it's nice, man. Really cool. And then here, guys, we have another staircase up to the same area. But guys, I want to go. Let's do the space. Ah. Guys, right here is actually the, the, the quote unquote pizza box I was talking about. Apparently, it's an in real life package that you could actually get from the game. It's actually really sick. This is his. This is the real life, like the, the real life one. How awesome. All right, guys, let's get inside of the rocket. So guys, I'm pretty sure the way this works is we go inside of this little... Uh, uh, what do you call it? Like, uh, insertion chamber? I don't even know what to call it, man. Uh, and by just going down here, we can go... Okay, Melly, you want to sit. Melly, you want to sit. Melly, you want to sit. We can go inside. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, we just get dropped off here. And then we get dropped. Okay, and we go that. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, oh! Okay. External handling step regulator. Do not touch. I touched it. I should not have touched it. Oh, no! This thing takes so much time to set up. Ah! Why did I not actually read? I'm such an idiot. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay, let's just do the tour. <laughs> so, guys, here we have the actual nose of it. This is apparently where you sit. But uh, we will just... <laughs> Uh, make the jump, boys. We, uh, we, but it, but it might want to be careful there. <laughs> oh, oh, so this is like a, oh, there's a, an emergency closure on this. How sick. So uh, I'm now the only one in here. Warning, checkpoint door gate. <laughs> All right, so guys, I'm currently inside of the actual rocket itself. Oh my God. So this is where the, oh, this is where all the fuel is. So guys, the, almost the entire other half of this rocket has been dedicated to speed and speed alone. Like it is insane. How awesome. This is so exciting. Well, I think we might have to actually relaunch the boat to actually you know i don't know go with it you know i don't know i didn't mess it up i think i let's just blame melon for that you know it wasn't me <laughs> all right guys we'll be back in like 20 minutes when this thing is set up again <laughs> all right guys so we're back right now and uh <laughs> Um, as you can see right here, there's actually more, uh, like, fire turbine. There's all kinds of more crazy stuff that I actually missed. Guys, there's this whole entire turbine that I missed. How awesome. So, like, what does this do? Does this just, like, regulate the regulator, ra raider, raider? Like, I feel like any time I read it just says, this regulates the regulator, raider, raider. It makes oxygen get into the turbine. I know. It sounds like the regulator got in the regulator, raider. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's actually get this thing started. All right, guys, so he has taught me the ways of controlling this beast of a machine. So, guys, first off, we're gonna have to uh, breathe air into the actual engine. Can we get a little zoom in there, Tom? All right, we're spinning up. We're spinning up. Very nice. All right, guys, next up, let's get ready for the actual launch. Three, two, one, go. All right, guys, we are heading into space. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dude, this is sick. Okay, 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 okay. Tell me when to press C. Tell me when to press C. Oh, my God. Okay, this is insane. Dude. Dude! Oh my god! C and E drop off the actual engine! And we are now in space. <laughs> Dude, that is by far like the sickest launch that I have ever seen in build a boat. Oh my god, this thing is so lag. Press X. Okay, X! <laughs> Dude, we just dropped off like two different pieces of our actual thing. That was insane. <laughs> Dude, this has by far been one of the craziest launches that I have ever done in build about. This was incredible. Oh my god. Absolutely mind-blowing, Arthur. You've absolutely smashed that. You know what? I do want to launch straight into all of the levels. <laughs> That would be insane. Let's walk around in space. Oh, oh yeah. Do I do it? Why can I not walk around in space, Arthur? What the heck? I thought this is meant to be low gravity. Damn it, man. Yeah, our rocket is still flying somewhere. In the Can we get a little zoom in right there? Little fly, little speck on our screen that it's still just flying off into the distance. <laughs> oh my god, man. I'm I am mind blown. That is by far the nicest launch that I've ever seen. That was crazy. Also, guys, these guys right here are actually some of the people that helped with the project. Harry R. Void guy CP. You, Fabby Ducklington, and DFS are some of the people that helped with this project. Uh, so a massive shout out to them as well. All right, guys. As you can see, we are set up once more. Guys, this time everything is going to be a little bit different. We are going to launch straight into the actual stages. Uh, I'm ready. Are you ready? Set ready. Let's start. I hope it will work. All right. Three, two, one, go. Oh my God. Oh my God. We're going a lot faster than we were earlier. Oh my God. Oh, oh I'm actually flying this thing. Oh my God. I'm actually doing it. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is actually really hard to control. Oh my God. This is awesome.
awesome. Oh my god, dude, this is insane. Bro, we've almost done it. Oh, we're almost at the end. Dude, I have never flown this big of a rocket actually to the end. Come on. Uh, we're so close. Come on. No. Oh, no. Ah. Come on, come on, come on. I can't be able to correct. No, the rockets ran out. Okay, F. Is that right? No, G. Uh, Q, C, E. Okay, we have a second boost. We have a second boost. No. Ah. Ah, I was so close. Oh my God. I would have cried, man. We were so close to doing it. How much gold did I get? I don't even remember. How much gold did you guys get? That was insane. All right, guys. But with that, we're going to end off today's video, guys. If you haven't already, like the video, subscribe to the channel, guys. Also, every single day, we are giving out uh, a free item in build um, Because currently, guys, I mean, I've recorded my videos a little bit ahead of time. So I started doing this three videos ago. But um, because I record three videos ahead, pretty much today's, we're going to give today's item to Arthur right here. And tomorrow, we are actually officially going to properly be giving items out to you guys. So, I don't even know what he wants. <laughs> Let's just give him... Mm, he seems like the kind of guy that would like himself some thrusters. <laughs> All right. There you go, my friend. Little gift for you guys. If you want to if you want to gift yourself, just comment your username, uh, what you got, what you want, and just subscribe to the channel. It's that easy. But I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, everyone. Bye-bye, man. Oh, what?